Hello everyone, welcome back for more. Let's play Strong Bad's Cool Game, Episode 4. Psst, you yeah, yeah, whatever. Don't tell me you're another one of Stinky's brothers. Jeez, how many of you guys are there? Four altogether. Now, did you come to do business? If not, then get lost. Wow. Attitude. You've got a real attitude, pal. I like that. So what's your story? Well, since you know my brother, they call me the moving man. I'm a professional fence. You got some merchandise that you obtain through questionable means? Get it to me and I can move it for you. I'll keep that in mind if I ever want to do any spring cleaning in my office. Okay. I'm sure you're aware that Sultry Buttons has stolen the purple nose of Cairo. Yeah, and it is a great loss to the country, but a possible great profit to me. Really? A purple nose? If you scratch it, it smells like boysenberries. It's a scratch and sniff treasure? Yup. Well, actually that is pretty cool. If you say so. In your line of work, you must have connections to Perducci. Is he here in Cairo? Oh yeah, I know Perducci. He and I go way back. But you won't find him in Cairo. I just sent him off to Tokyo to move some counterfeit movie tie-in merchandise. So uh. that's where all that cheap junk is coming from. I'm trying to catch a beautiful jewel thief. Hmm. If you Same as every other informant there. Take a look at this painting. Anyone ever try to move this thing through you? Yeah, I remember Perducci stole this from the mummy's tomb one fall a long time ago. You remember it being in the fall? Yeah, well, business is slow in the fall. Something like that painting comes through and you remember it. Indeed. Okay. I've heard enough, but if you ever run into someone needing to get rid of some stolen jetpack boots, you know who to call. Sure, and if you happen to run into any of my tree brothers, give them a big hug for me. Yeah, I'm not gonna do that. Yeah, probably not. But there should... It's either here or... It's... it's either here or Tokyo. You need some information? No, nope, not here. It would have gone off. There's not enough room for it to hide too well. But we need to go to Tokyo now. Japan! Wow, this place looks so different from any other country I've visited. So different. Uh-huh. It is different cardboard, anyway. Let's switch at the podium. He, he has no the eyes. swollen jade tick. I'm glad this one was stolen. Ticks bug me. <laughs> they tick me off. <laughs> they really suck, right? Comic relief. Anyway. Something I can help you? Shut your face! Psst. What happened Are to you? Are you dangerous? Eyes? I see my legend precedes me. My brother said to expect you. Do you have any questions for me? Uh huh. So, who are you supposed to be? Just call me Stooly Rat Weasel. Only if you pay me. I'm a double agent working to gather info for both sides. If you have anything that you need information on, just show it to me. He seems trustworthy, what well, with the lack of eyes and all. What do you know about the swollen jade tick? Ah, a rare and beautiful treasure. They say it was pulled from the backside of an ancient jade elephant. Okay, okay, stop talking, stop talking. Ghibli. I'm looking for a fugitive named Perducci. That name mean anything to you? Yeah, I know Perducci. I've been gathering intel on him for years. He was here not long ago. You just missed him. My sources say he may be heading to a safe house in Paris. Yeah. Ah, the old safe house in Paris gimmick. I should have known. 
I'm trying to catch a. B hmm. If you want to. Yeah, same exact thing. Hey, you got any intel on this baby? Of course. Perducci and I worked together to steal this from an ancient temple in Japan. Can that information really? help me find him now? I don't think so. Well, that's no fun. That's a little off from everyone else. Hmm. Keep on playing both sides, Rat Wheezy. Don't worry about me. And if you need any more help in your travels, just look up any of my three brothers. But now... Something I can help you with, stranger? Yeah. Somewhere out there's a bullet with my name on it. But not this one. This one's been monogrammed by Perducci! So we finally have a bullet. Ah. Uh, lovely. Well, time to go to Paris. Not like that. I'll always have Paris, right here on my map. Uh, Paris is now in Asia. It's better it than Ireland. What, no paper airplane flying across? Wait, Sultry! Man, I gotta find a way to get here before she leaves. Yes, you do. Paris, the city of romance. Many a hearts and winds I have broken here. Probably at the same time. So what's here? Your eyes are missing again, mostly. The diamond tipped diamond. I oh. heard this thing can cut through just about every material known to man. It's probably what sultry buttons used to cut through the security glass to steal it. Somehow. That that'd be a good trick. Hey you, have you seen You are troubled with father issues? This has made it hard for you to define which side of the law you are on, and why you choose to work alone, except when you work with your partner. Which is all the time. Yeah. What are you, another psychic? I'm a psychological profiler. I can give you a psychological profile of a person just by evaluating their belongings. Did you see a woman come through here and steal a ginormous diamond? Um, nope. Not that I know of. What? Aren't you supposed to know everything about the seedy criminal activity around here? I'm sure if there was anyone around here fitting a criminal profile, I would know about it. Look, there's a big empty pedestal over there that previously displayed something that I wanted to take. I mean, protect. Protect. Sorry. Must not have been very important. Hmm. I'm searching for a man named Perducci! Well, what can you tell me about him? Hmm, he's fat, wears a blue suit, dumb hat, crusty white beard and mustache, and smells a bit like peppermint and gravy. This sounds like a desperate man. He's frightened and may have gone into hiding. So how can I find him? He's probably trying to blend into the crowd. Perhaps in a place where everyone wears funny hats. And smells a bit minty. So, Ireland? Maybe. I'm trying to catch a beauty. Hmm. If you. Okay, same exact thing there. What can you tell me about a man who would steal something like this? Oh my! That's. Well, anyone who steals that is highly disturbed. Strangely. That same painting appears in an old case file of mine I wrote way back in the fall of 1963. Wow, that is a coincidence. Hmm. I can't believe I haven't found Perducci yet. I've already been to five different countries and talked to five of these stupid brothers. But wait, Stinky said he only had three brothers. Something is fishy. One of these guys is lying. And when I figure out who it is, I'm gonna pull out my trusty nunchuck gun, poke it into their doughy belly, and nunchuck gun the crap out of them until they give up the info I need. No one protects Perducci in my town and gets <laughs> away with it. I guess he got sick of saying it like that. 
Well, it should be fairly obvious which one the odd man out is, but so far everyone ex that everyone else, all the true brothers, quote unquote, have mentioned something about Fall 1963 or Mummies 2. There was only one who said it was somewhere else. And that guy's back in Tokyo. So let's ha let's pay him a visit. <laughs> but actually, let's pay someone else a visit first. Let's go back to Cairo. Wait, Just so you can see what happens if you. Man, the wrong I gotta here. find a way to get here before she leaves. Which isn't much, but you know. Hey, his eyes are back. Hold it right there, meat pie. Why are you lying to me? What are you talking about? The painting wasn't stolen from any ancient temple. I don't know anything about that. Are you sure that wasn't you? I get you guys confused. All right, forget I was ever here. Yeah, so you get to pick from one of the, uh... Hey, mole guy! You get to pick from one of the, Stay uh... Stay out of trouble, or I'll be things. back for you. Hang on, I gotta take this. You got dangerous. Who this is? Angus Q! I just got an important tip concerning Perducci! Apparently, he's passing himself off as some kind of underworld informant! Informant? I just brutally interrogated a bunch of those guys. Well, find out which one's been lying to you. That's your guy. Thanks for the tip, Diamonicle. And here's another tip. If you need that extra boost of energy, <laughs> but don't want all the sugar, Diet Bull Honky brand caffeine energy sauce is... Looks like this zookeeper's gotta clear the muffins out of the pantry. Indeed. Well, let's see what the reactions are to the other. Going somewhere? Not really. I pretty much just stay here. So stay there, and tell me why your story doesn't add up. What part doesn't make sense? The painting wasn't stolen in the fall. That's not true. My brother in Paris knows all about it. Ask him. Okay, okay. Your story checks out. This time. Yeah, but it won't it won't stay there for much longer. So now let's go ahead and go to Tokyo. Miss her again. And call this guy out on his bold face lying to us. Even though we can't read his face because there are no eyes there to read. Are you protecting Perducci? What? Your story is full of lies that have holes in them. What part? The painting wasn't stolen from any ancient temple. So? So, you told me that you helped Perducci steal the painting from an ancient temple in Japan. But that is clearly not true because two of the brothers told me this painting was stolen from a mummy's tomb. You're not one of the brothers. Why are you protecting Perducci? Very clever, Dangerous. You have seen through my carefully crafted ruse. I'm not protecting Perducci. I am Perducci! Now kindly give me back my painting! What's so important about this painting? Just give it! The A disc! disc. Aha! You lose again, Perducci! I knew I shouldn't have stashed the painting under that bridge! May have beaten me this time, dangerous, but I'll be back! <laughs> and see! Well, that's it for me! I'll see you at the premiere! If you need me for pickups, call my agent! And that is done. <sighs> so we have the disc. Now we just need to work on getting that ruby back. And. That's going to take a couple of minutes to take care of. And we've got some awesomeness to dig up. In this case, quite literally. So, I will see everyone back next time when hopefully 
I can get through all the steps to get that ruby. Take care, folks. See you later.